Welcome to Oxford, Mississippi, day two of the 2020 Ole Miss Classic. We've got the two teams who are perfect so far this weekend as Missouri State takes on Ole Miss here on the SEC Network. This ball sliced out to left, a diving effort by the left fielder, Jessica Puck. My goodness, what a grab. Morgan jams Craybeal. Tough play for Smith to flip it over to first, but gets it there in time to stifle Ole Miss once again. The 2-2 pitch. Jams her to second base. This is Minish trying to get it over to first in time and does. Fly ball to right, Latham a few steps forward, one step back to make the third and final out of the inning. Grounded left side off the glove of Craybeal. It's going to be an RBI ground out. After a lengthy battle, this ball belted out to center field. Plummer standing up at second with a double. But put down perfectly. No play to be made at first. Then the gun to third. Nabs the lead runner. Dickerson ground ball to second. Borgen escapes the jam and maintains the one nothing lead heading to the home half of the fourth. Smith Gutierrez Alley do up for the Rebels. Jones 60 feet away. Can Alvarez bring her home? Slow roar to third. Craybeal to first to get the out. Brings up Peyton Minnis. Diving stop from Gutierrez to throw to second. Gets the lead runner. Another slow roller to third. Long throw for Roth. Another ball up in the air. This one to shallow center field. In comes Whitley for another incredible grab. Ground ball to first. Gutierrez drops to a knee, hustles to the bag, and Anna Borgen has herself a complete game shutout of the Missouri State Bears. Final score at the Ole Miss Softball Complex. Rebels 1, Bears 0. For our entire crew, for Mr. Dickerson, I'm Seth Austin saying so long from Oxford. Final score once again, Rebels 1, Bears 0.